Hi guys, welcome back to the channel guys. This is the Imerio family. If this is your first time, you know, coming across my channel. Okay, this is the Imerio family. Please, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. But if you have subscribed, God bless you. For my returning subscriber, I appreciate you. Alright, please remember to subscribe and give the video a thumbs up. Alright, so today I will be cooking a Nigeria Jello fries, okay? So, uh, sorry I did um, film before I bought the meat. I forgot before I remember how I'm too supposed to film. So, here is the chicken, guys. So, I'm frying it now. Alright, so let me show you guys because we are cooking this food together. <laughs> All right, so let's get started, guys. So this is it. So here is my tomatoes, tomatoes and onions and pepperoni, guys. All right, so I've already blended, blend all of them together. So I parboiled the tomatoes to dry water so that it doesn't bite. Okay, I like to use fresh tomatoes for my um, jello fries, okay? So here is my rice. Here is the rice that I want to use to cook the jello rice, okay? So, here is, so I've already put oil in the fire, so I added salt. So, when I put in to, uh, onions, as you can see, so it's cooking, guys. <laughs> oh, God, this is, uh, this recipe is nice. The food was so yummy. Make sure you stay uh, tuned, okay? Make sure you watch, you watch the video to the end, okay? All right, so after you allow the onions to boil a little bit, to cook a little bit, so I add my already uh, steamed tomatoes, as you can see. All right, so I have to stir it together, okay? All right, so I'll allow it to cook for some minutes, okay? After that, I'll start adding my spices. Here is nutmeg. Okay, add nut. I added nutmeg and curry. This is curry, guys. I add my curry. Then um, after that, I also add my thyme. I added my thyme. Okay, because jello fries you need spices, guys. You need spices to spice it up for you to be you know yummy 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 <laughs> god this was really nice anyway it was nice this food was so sweet okay what about this this, this, this gist i'm hearing about a meddling boy snatching her best friend her husband here is our uh, spices also maggie spices for jollof rice okay I, uh, I brought it all the way from Nigeria. Yes, <laughs> Nigeria can never leave you. Never, never. Okay. So about the gist I was telling you guys about the meddling yeah, lady. I don't know if you guys heard the news. I read it on Insta, um, on Instagram. Where yeah, they said she snatched her bestie husband. If it's true, I mainly did not do it, but I don't want to believe it anyway. So here I'm adding my Maggi. I add Maggi, one, one cube of Maggi, because I, if you have watched my video, I don't like too much Maggi in my, my food. Maggi does not make food to be sweet, okay? You just you, uh, make use of little quantity, all right? Because every, too much of everything is bad. All right, so here is my chicken stock. All right, after the tomatoes have boiled and steamed, now add after the spices, you now add your chicken stock. Okay, so you cover the pot. Uh, you allow it uh, to boil. I forgot to tell you guys, I changed the pot. Guys, yeah, this was only the pot I used to fry the tomatoes i don't want the rice to burn uh, the pot to be too hot so that it's not burn too much because this i like i like to use this pot to cook my jello fry because of the burnt i like to perceive the burnt you know and that will be the main thing now <laughs> okay guys so let's stay so i've added uh, my rice now you know you have to keep stirring so that it doesn't get too much uh, it doesn't get burnt too much okay so here it is 
you see the way I'm you know I stir it continuously until it dry water okay so uh, as I was saying before about the cheese if, if it's true that Merlin really did that he did, he, she did not do well at all so here is it's time to add butter do you know I forgot that I don't have butter at home I forgot to this is a, a little one that I have at home I have to make use of it I thought I have I still have inside the fridge okay because I use butter a lot all right so the rice is almost dry of water so it's time for me now and I added onions okay I like that flavor that flavor you know when the food is almost done you now add put onions especially on jollof rice it brings us a very nice flavor okay nice uh, aroma not <laughs> say flavor it brings out nice aroma so you see you still because here the rice is not very soft it's still hard a little bit so and i have to cover it with foil paper okay so that it can heat up and soft to my own satisfaction okay okay to what i want <laughs> okay so here is the rice it's almost ready my god this rice here i wish you guys this, this is so yummy it's so nice it's not because i'm not just praising it because of it's me that cook the food you know it's when you see the when you see truth you, you you say it okay this this food this food is so yummy so try this recipe and i I'm telling you you will not regret it okay here the food is ready guys <laughs> Thank you. If you are still watching till now, God bless you. Please remember to subscribe, okay? Join the families, okay? Build the channel with me and as you support me, may God Almighty support you as well. Okay, this rice, rice is ready. See how scanty it is. Even despite I didn't have much butter, it still looks so nice and it tastes so yummy. So here is the chicken to step it down. Thank you for 